While clearing your map with warriors, you find a corner base. You know you don't have the GBE to clear mines and still afford your shocks, so you decide, eh, I'll just run through them. What's the worst that could happen? So you flare your anchor point, smoke up, start running up the right wall, and uh, uh it, uh, oh, 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 oh boy. Hey guys, it's Ryan. Welcome back to the PSC Life. In today's quick episode, you're trying to get your warriors from the beach to the HQ, but you need a way to navigate the mines along the path. If you have enough troop damage for the job, but you need to conserve GVE, use a mine clearing warrior boat. To do this, deploy one warrior boat, then just as your last warrior is leaving, deploy your other boats and flare your very end target. Let's watch one more replay. This time we'll deploy our first boat, and then the rest of our boats a moment later. It's important to flare all the way to the back destination so that your warriors don't group up again and undo what you've been trying to do the whole time. You can see you'll go right through the mines, but only the front seven or eight warriors will actually take damage from them. So you'll get to the core with seven full boats and just one that's been damaged instead of all eight being damaged. Using this strategy, you'll be able to make it to your destination with enough GBE to do everything else you need for a successful attack. I hope you guys enjoyed this tip. Let me know what you thought or what you'd like to see next time. I'll leave you with my replay of the week. Until next time, my name is Ryan, this is the PSC Life, and I'll see you guys next time. Happy booming! What do you call that one? The full frontal assault of stupid.